All right, everyone. I finally got some real progress on the garden, so I figured I'd do a quick update for you all. Okay, yesterday I got some stuff planted in this bed here. Um, I have a mix of different things in here. I did a couple of the broccoli plants that I got from the store already started. Um, there's a broccoli seedling there that I started myself and a couple of the cabbage plants that I got. And then over there I have some Brussels sprouts in the middle and some cauliflower over on the far side. And then down here I uh, seeded a couple more broccoli, cauliflower, and Brussels sprouts yesterday. So hopefully they all survive then they'll be uh, ready to harvest at different times so we won't get overwhelmed with too much of one thing all at once. Um, it's around 60 degrees outside now and it looks like it's about 66 or so inside here. Um, it was over 70 before I propped the, uh, the windows on this side open. Um, also, the humidity has gone up. It was about 10% this morning and now it's around 20. It's still a little lower than I'd like. Um, I did add a can of water in here and in my cold frame over there I have a, a glass jar of water. I'm just going to experiment with that and see if that adds a little bit more humidity uh, to these beds. I am a little bit worried that with the glass it will dry, dry the soil out way too fast. But I'm pretty happy with this. Um, seems to be keeping them pretty warm and sheltered. So hopefully this can, I mean realistically, if this uh, turns out to work then that's a month to a month and a half of extra growing time I've gotten out of this. Now over here in this small one, I put in my spinach and my beets. Um, the spinach are, well the spinach and the beets are all looking pretty sad. They all went through that trauma with the plastic greenhouse last weekend, getting all dumped out and having to be repotted. And then they had the shock of being transplanted this morning, so I'm not sure how they'll end up doing. Um, I planted a couple more spinach seeds over there this morning. I had five beets that appeared to survive last weekend's trauma, so we'll see how they all do. Um, I'm using these windows basically at night. I'll put them on to keep a little, trap a little bit more of the heat inside there, but during the day I'll leave them off because beets and spinach are both more cold hardy. So that's something I got going this morning. And then the final thing, so I'm still using this one primarily as a cold frame, um, kind of slowly acclimatize some of these plants to being outdoors, but here I planted a bunch of kitchen scraps that we've been regrowing in water inside. So there's some celery there closest to us, a couple of leeks, and then a bunch of green onions. And I'm hoping that these start to grow better now that they're outside, they have a better diet, they have more sun. Um, and I mean, it'll be nice to have our own source of leeks and green onions here, not have to get them from the store anymore. I'm planning on growing both of those, but it, It'll still be a while before they're ready to produce anything, so hopefully this will speed things up for us. I hope you enjoyed this garden update. If you did, make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. And check back soon for more updates from the Trailer Park Homestead. Thanks.